Okay, so this is big, but I just want to get this as uh, some clues around this. So, during this mysterious message that appeared at Money in the Bank, this is where it all started. It all started, this footage came out at Money in the Bank, and it appeared on Raw, and it appeared twice the next week on Raw with different footages. Now, you're wondering who that could be. And that would be none other than the rated all superstar, Edge. Now, of course, some people are saying Edge may be coming back to the WWE. Now, the last time Edge was seen in WWE was when he was rejected from a group called the Judgment Day. And I love Judgment Day, I, and I love the promo that was been, that's been happening through recent weeks on Raw. But these are actually tease of Edge coming back, probably with the evil gimmick. Now, it may be Brood Edge. It could be a different version of Edge, probably. But I would say he may be coming back as Brood Edge. But for some reason, some people are saying it is... um. Limpa Gold metal as Gable Steven. That cannot be Gable Steven. But, no, it's not, though. So, as you can see through the images, you see Mick Foley's jacket. And then another part where you see RKO, representing rated RKO. And as you keep going through these images, you can see Mick Foley's jacket again being burned. And then you see a John Cena hat with the You Can't See Me and all that. So these are reference to Edge's past rivals. Some of his greatest rivals. Then you can see a cup of blood as representing the brood. You see somebody writing something which flashes up really quickly. We'll keep going. And you can see candles uh, all over the place representing for brood edge and all that. Then you see another Olympic gold medal representing Kurt Angle. So yeah. You see the candles again but they're all out for some reason so yeah then you see this random uh what do you call i don't know probably an hourglass but there's one more person that people think it may be none other than bray wyatt aka the fiend now in 2021 bray got released from wwe for some reason now I don't know if it is Bray Wyatt coming back, but I do know there's a 50 chance he may be coming back, but there's a 100% that it may be Ed. So about that <laughs> mistake there, but yeah, who do you think that could be? Is it Ed or is it Bray Wyatt? Let me know your thoughts in the comments and I'll see you guys next time.